here, dude. So I was about to say, I'm Every pretty sure week I come out, I'm like, I was Ooh. literally about to say, there's only one King Momo, and he's like right there. Like, That's what I'm saying. Screen. But I uh, internalize the CFL meme. Who is King Momo? Oh, oh, you're like, oh, shoot. Like, you're, Lord, like, you're in it. You're like in it to win it, is what you're saying. Loses uh, finals, OC Zach Baraka. Double Marth against two spaces. Yeah, caught off the win against Odi and uh, Gatsu. Let's see what they can do. I think that they're going to really struggle just because Momo is so aggressive. And like you said, the Marth, like, their advantages are holding space. Whereas Momo doesn't want that to happen at all. Oh, yeah, really for sure. Both with. these characters will, like, will definitely, like, get in your space and be like, What's up? Yeah. What's up? How you doing? Definitely the, uh, uh, it's always sunny, what up? <laughs> Have you seen that? <laughs> yeah. What up? What up? Oh, good combo. Again, dude. But you can see the dynamic here where Baraka is really playing the aggressor. Uh -huh. Baraka and Zach is playing the support yeah. in like having those two roles in yeah. the same character team. Baraka tried to up tilt uh, three times and got nothing out of it. Uh, up tilt is a trap. Just saying, like it's probably like one of the best combos Marth has. You shouldn't use it ever, obviously. It's a trap. See, but this happened in the previous sets that I saw that I saw Momo play. He just oh, like puts himself into crazy situations. Nice. I was about to say like questionable coverage, uh, and, like on that edge guard, but they had it. Dude, it's it's silly to think about it, but it takes a lot to just hold the ledge, dude. Especially starting off as a new player. Yeah, it, just it, straight well, up like, holding the ledge, does, like even. Like, even against, like, certain characters, uh, up east, like, it'd be really scary. Yeah, Marth is so ambiguous, yeah, like, you have Fox, so many options. Like, if you're Fox, uh, and Marth is, like, coming at you with the up B, and, like, you're just a little bit off on your invincibility timing, you will get clipped, yeah. and, like, you're gonna fall stupid fast. I think that's, like, you a huge indicator of a die. really great player, dude. You could just die. Baraka with a double down there, and then... Baraka Ooh. tried to clip Pangi out of the air, but he didn't quite get it. See, but this, the pace of this game is so much different yeah. than the previous set because you have these two really double aggressive spaces. players yeah. and the characters in and of themselves. Yeah, when See, you have like, when you have like the kind of double support archetype with yeah. like the double offense archetype. And the thing that I was just mentioning, holding the ledge, knowing when to let go of it, knowing when to press L, all that kind of stuff, uh, and led to Baraka still holding onto a stock. Ooh. Thunder held out forever, dude. Oh, this space to down smash. Hanging on just barely, though. This oh, is scary, dude. Number time? Yeah, he just runs up and up smashes. That's what you gotta do. For sure. Interesting that he would go for back air. That, oh, Yo, see, that's what I'm talking yep. about. It's spoopy, dude. Oh, that was nice. That was nice. It was a really nice way. Yeah. But see, dude, all the things that we're providing insightful commentary to the stream. Are we, though? Steps, dude. Are we? We're making the positive. Jimmy's over here looking like, nah, dude, this is the worst commentary I've ever heard, which is not totally inaccurate. It's pretty accurate. Dang. Happy birthday to uh, Jimmy, our stream uh, guru. What are we doing, dude? What are we doing for the birthday? I'm commentating getting, the match. I'm That's getting cool. him a beer later. Uh, Jimmy's my boy. So, uh, naturally, two moths would favor going oh, yeah, to FD. Sure. Why do you think they didn't ban it? Um, they probably banned like Yoshi's. Because, because I think, of what happened last game. Yeah. Or last set, rather. Oh, it's also best of five. They're also Oh, no interesting. Oh, my God. That was the most demanding down air I've ever seen. And we see, um, we see this team really thriving on this, this counter pick, so. Uh, they're, are, you, are you talking about double Marth? No, dude. I'm talking about, uh, oh, yeah. oh, they won. Never mind. Never mind. I'm going to buzz it. No, you're good. Really? You're good. I was about to say, because they're getting down like a couple stocks. But again, Baraka with those, like, you said that he did those three up tilts. Yeah, just goes for the up tilt, and it, it works out in his favor that time. Dude, sometimes. Martha's, I'm not going to lie. Martha doesn't have uh, as many privileges as top, other top tier characters, but when he has privilege, when he gets like that top tier privilege, it's like really good privilege. Yeah. It's Just like stand it up to it. it's like stand there and up tilt three times in a row and then kill them. Like how great is that? How great of privilege is that? Like she doesn't have that privilege. She can four tilt three times in a row and then like lead to like like extend the punish. Yeah. But like eventually you'll get the combo or like the kill. But Marth, 
up tilt, up tilt, up tilt, down air. And that's it. If you win. Really good. <laughs> it's great. These guys are playing, um, oh, even though tipper. The, the momentum has shifted a little bit, well, they're still up, but Momo and Pengi, like really increase their level of communication. Like, yeah. just team combos on deck. <laughs> this guy's just... They're both, they're with, both uh, trying to run in right now. Uh, maybe they just need... He's really might, holding his ground, though. Yeah, they're definitely... They're not doing poorly at all. Uh... It might just take them a few more games to get used to like each other. Yeah. You know what I mean? <laughs> but Osizak is really doing great zoning with his uh, with forward air, just making sure he ha he has his space. Oh my goodness, man. that's impressive, dude. Yeah. Look at this. Uh, yeah, he tried to shield grab. It didn't poke. It was just uh really great match. I enjoy. Enjoy this thoroughly, dude. Six cliff? Dang! Okay, are we clipping? We got clipping. Looking like a Street Fighter V at release, dude. Clipping. Oh, are we clipping? Looking like Davy Diggs, dude. Clipping. I have. You know who? You don't know who Davy Diggs is? Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. That kid's super dope. Super dope. Baraka with the standing up tilts. Oh yeah. Let's see, these guys are. Uh, they were in they, both marks. They were in a tough situation. They were both in the corner. One of them was like, "All right, it's time to dash dance," which maybe is the correct thing to do when you're cornered. But like when you're double marked and your team is right on top of you, you limit a lot of your options by dashing. Eh, good backer from Mark. That's something you see too often. What I like is that uh, Momo had the presence of mind to back air more in order to get some like space for Pengi. <laughs> doubles is nuts, dude. Oh, so doubles. much awareness. I used to hate doubles. I love doubles now. Did you read the guide? The NMW guide? No. Are you kidding me, dude? So many resources at our fingertips. I did, not read, I did not read the NMW, you guys. Actually, I think I did, and it didn't help me at all. I'm so serious. But now you know, dude. Maybe now you know that Oh, no. Did those lasers just kill Pengi? Yeah, they did. Did you see him? He just talked about it. He just, like, laughed it off and was like, oh, shit. Oh, my boy got shot up, dude. Yeah. My boy got shot up. No way. Falco is up a whole other stop. Like, they're working together, but I, I don't think that they're... They have too much you, synergy in their choosing. Yeah, are you referring, referring to, to King Momo? Okay, okay. Because they're they're working together. They're they're like forcing a two v one situation. Ooh. But it's not really working. They're not like choosing the right moves to help each other out. That's unfortunate. A little miscommunication between the blue team there as well. They both went out for that edge guard. Uh, they both kind of paid for it a little bit. I like that back air from Baraka just to keep uh, Momo off stage. Yeah, super good. Didn't quite net him the kill, but like. Yeah. That's free percentage. And it, like and every it, time, like even if you like edge guard, like even if you yeah. get someone in an edge guard situation, uh, you they're still like expending like you know percent yeah. in, a, in effect to like try to get back to stage. If and you it's hit speech volumes. Again. It tells yeah. you I'm going out for this edge guard. I'm gonna do it. So and limit your options. Oh no, that was almost the dankest combo uh, imaginable by Osuzak. Didn't quite work out though. Up or, or that up smash is not All right, If Baraka can make it down, make something I do like that, um, that follow from Peggy with the uh, up air. This guy's on another level. Okay. But Baraka's got to make some cheese happen here. He's chilling near the edge. That's totally a good idea, to be honest. Oh, my gosh. That was yeah, interesting. Yeah, dang. Do you think he was going for the up B? So much longer. I'm not sure. It's hard to say. It was interesting to see the dynamic of 